Hey everybody, Pastor Stump from Zion Blue Mountain United Church of Christ. I want to give you what will hopefully be the first of many periodic reports on the life of what's going on here at Zion Blue Mountain. First, I want to talk to you a little bit about what our plans are for worship this Sunday. And to do that, I'd like to talk about last Sunday a little bit as well. Last week, we talked about how foreign dignitaries of even a different faith than Jesus came from across the land and traveled probably for many months to see the gift that they knew had come into this world and, and recognize that gift. A few weeks before that, we even talked about the shepherds being able to recognize that and see that as well. We're going to take a jump from there, from them knowing that this was a gift from the divine in the birth of Christ to that acknowledgement or re-acknowledgement of it in the baptism of Jesus when God says, this is my son with whom I am well pleased. And then we're going to even connect that this week, Jesus' baptism, to your baptism as well. So we invite you to come here and to recall your baptism. If you're a person who has not been baptized or doesn't even know what baptism is about in our faith tradition, please come anyway. We are sure you will find value and welcome in this place, being in community with one another. And feel free to speak with me or someone else about your questions after the worship or even before. We have a couple other things, though, to talk about this week in the life of our church. This coming Thursday, which will be tomorrow uh, evening, our mission committee meets at 7 p.m. right here in this room, what we call our library. Uh, we invite anyone in the church to come and bring your ideas, even if you don't desire to actually serve long term on this committee. We're really looking forward to a year full of mission opportunities and experiences where we can grow our faith. Friday evening, we have our monthly bingo. The kitchen opens at 5 p.m. Even if you don't want to play bingo, this is a good place to come get a good bite to eat. Uh, just come around the back of the church to where our fellowship parking is, and you'll be able to follow the crowd in um, and, and get a bite to eat from good, pretty good home cooking, uh, if I may say so. The first games start at 6.30, and again, the kitchen opens up at 5. Also, I want to let you know that every month, at least one of our games goes to a charity. And this month, uh, especially in light of the recent earthquake in Puerto Rico with our brothers and sisters there uh, being devastated. We are going to be giving uh, that charitable game proceeds to the United Church of Christ Disaster Ministries Fund as they do a lot of great work here in our country and around the world. Uh, Sunday we have worship at 8 a.m. and 10.30 a.m. The 8 a.m. worship is a little bit shorter, about 45 minutes long. It's a bit more contemplative and quiet. There is no music during that service, uh, but people find it a very rich and valuable experience to connect to one another and to God. In between those services at 9 a.m., we have our fundraising committee meeting. So again, if you'd like to share new ideas or work on being a part of some of our old favorites, come to that meeting as well. Also, all morning on Sunday from 7 a.m. to 12 a.m. to 12 noon is the breakfast, the monthly breakfast at the Strauss Town Fire Company, which I have not yet been able to attend, but I've heard great things about, and I'm looking forward to hopefully getting there this week. Again, that's at uh, the Strauss Town Fire Company right down the road from the church on Route 183, uh, and it is a pretty good breakfast from, from all that I hear. That's from 7 a.m. to 12 a.m. We're also in the middle of collecting blankets for uh, support of the Salvation Army blanket drive. So please bring, we prefer to get uh, new blankets here if you can. I uh, just myself went uh, perusing the Dollar General store down the road today and you can get blankets in price ranges everywhere from five to $25. So please buy uh, what you can and bring them by here. Our goal is to collect 50 uh, blankets with that. And then next Thursday uh, is our monthly food pantry. Come on out to that uh, to help if you would like to, uh, to see how the operation unfolds. Or if you are in need, if you are a family living within the Topahawk in our Hamburg school districts, we are here to serve you. Last month we served about 60 families. Um, and I have to say, I really was impressed with the operation and the sense of community among all people, those working and those being served. So if you have any other questions about these events, please email uh, the church or give us a call and stay tuned for more information on our Facebook page. Take care church.